Hi there, everybody. I'm Adam Kruger inside the Devaney Center in Lincoln, where Husker fans got their first look at the 2021 Fall Nebraska Volleyball team here on Saturday night. During starting lineups, Husker players going into the stands and handing volleyballs out. Pick up the action in the first set. Kayla Caffey with the kill, putting the white squad up by three. Then later on in the first set, it's Kaylin Meyer coming through with the block. The white team wins the first set 25 to 22. To the second set, another freshman, Whitney Lawnstein, with the kill of her own. Then set point for the red in set two. Ali Batenhorst, another fab freshman. Red team takes set two, 26 to 24. Jump ahead to the third now, Lexi Sun, the super senior coming through with the kill, putting the white team up 13 to eight. Then later in the third, Omaha Scott Catholic alum, Lindsey Krause coming through with the smashing spike. The white would win game three by a score of 25 to 13. To the fourth set, a scary moment here. Senior setter, Nicklin Hames, Coming down what appears to be a lower body injury. She would be helped off the court and not return. Coach Cook uncertain of the extent of Hames' injury. As the match would end in a two-all tie. She's a tough kid and she was crying, so you know, I'm, I'm a little bit concerned, but she's also a tough kid and you know she hasn't she hasn't gotten hurt in four years, so that's it's a pretty un, unusual deal. The Huskers, though, were happy to have fans back in the Devaney Center after an absence of nearly two years. Our, some of our players were having emotionally were having a hard time. I mean, they were very emotional like walking in there. We all felt it. Before the game, we were all like shocked that it was actually happening and that we would actually have a full Bob Devaney Sports Center for the first time in two years. When I was up there getting introduced, I literally, like it brought me to tears just hearing the crowd scream and like cheer for us and just to get another opportunity to be able to play this season. NU opens the season Friday at 11 a.m. against Tulsa. 